Most landscapers, professional gardeners, and those who use outdoor power equipment are well acquainted with the name Steel. Steel is a respected provider of quality chainsaws, blowers, vacuums, hedge trimmers, grass trimmers, and sprayers. One of Steel's 12 wholesalers is Mississippi Valley Steel. Headquartered in Peoria, Illinois, this company's 32,000 square foot distribution center provides equipment and repair parts to servicing lawn and garden and industrial dealers throughout Iowa and northern Illinois. The company only sells to independent dealers and garden centers and not to the big box retailers. Just a few years ago, Mississippi Valley Steel was facing a space crunch caused by growth in the business, an enhanced product line, and an ever-increasing number of repair parts that required stocking for its dealers. The company then picked its parts using paper lists. The parts were stored on 8,500 square feet of shelving. Now those same parts, and many more, are housed in vertical lift modules from Hanel Storage Systems. The VLMs occupy a footprint of only 128 square feet. Besides providing denser storage, Mississippi Valley Steel also saw additional needs that the installation addressed. The real goal was for our customers. We needed to improve the accuracy uh, that we had, and we also need to get the timeliness up. Our customers demand that they get their orders either the next day or the following day, depending on the UPS shipping. We store about uh, 7,500 SKUs on here. The machines cube the parts very well, so everything's stacked in a very small, tight area. So the amount of space that we have to walk to retrieve those parts is very, very, very limited. The four vertical lift modules work in tandem to pick orders. Picking is continuous, as product can be selected from one machine, while the other three units retrieve trays for additional picks. In such a design, picking speed and volumes are equivalent or better than similar applications using horizontal carousels or mini load systems. The big advantage is we used to have uh, five, six people just picking parts in this area. Now we have one doing it and we go home at 4.30, 5 o'clock as opposed to working the overtime hours, which would take us till 7 o'clock at night sometimes. Most items are manufactured at Steel's factory in Virginia Beach. Upon arrival, whole goods of new equipment are loaded into pallet racks. The bottom two levels of the racks are reserved for picking, with reserve items stored above. Each day, items are moved from the upper levels to replenish the pick zones on the bottom levels. Incoming repair parts are also loaded into the vertical lift modules. The system determines the proper space to allocate to each SKU based on volume and density. Each VLM has photo sensors that automatically measure the height of items in each tray. The system then determines the optimal storage location to maximize density, reducing the space between the trays to less than an inch and a half. Mississippi Valley Steel is committed to same-day fulfillment on all orders received by 2 o'clock p.m. About 90% of incoming orders require parts picked from the vertical lift modules. The Nova software that coordinates picks in the VLMs also manages inventory in the entire warehouse, as well as directs all order filling. To begin, orders are downloaded to the VLM's workstation for batch picking of up to 14 orders at once. Totes representing each order are staged at put-to-light stations adjacent to the vertical lift modules. A packing list and labels are printed and inserted into each tote. The vertical lift modules then begin bringing trays from storage to their processing windows. A computer display screen shows the SKUs and quantities that need to be picked. An additional display above each processing window also shows the location of the SKU in the delivered tray and the quantity needed. The worker selects the required parts and places them into a small bag. She then labels the bag and deposits it into the proper tote as indicated by the put to light system. The processing area also contains flow racks for the fastest moving SKUs. These are selected using pick to light with the items removed from the racks and placed into the totes in the same manner as items from the VLMs. Once all picks for an order have been completed, the tote is pushed off onto a takeaway conveyor for a short ride to a packaging area. Here, each item is double-checked against the printed packing list and placed into a shipping carton. Many orders also require additional picks of new equipment from the pallet racks. These are selected using labels. The items are removed from the racks, placed onto a pallet jack, and taken to the packing area where they are added to the cartons of parts selected from the vertical lift modules. The loads are then strapped, palletized, and wrapped as needed before being staged for loading onto trucks. Since installing the vertical lift modules, Mississippi Valley Steel has been able to absorb its growth. Without them, the company would have had to expand its building to accommodate its growing inventory. 
but there have been other benefits as well. Our accuracy has gone up to 99.9% and we do ship uh, all the orders that are in-house, we ship out same day. We now have the premium uh, uh, shipping facility of any outdoor power equipment distributor in the United States. That says a lot about the type of, uh, of future that steel holds and about our company and what we hold for the future. It's the consistency of what we're able to do now. I can, I can leave here at night and I know that every order's gone. I know that every order's gone accurately. And with our old system, I didn't always, uh, we didn't always have that feeling when we left at the end of the day, whether every order was really gone or not. Now we do.